back it up a little bit here. See a little more there. So we'll bring it up a little bit. And right at the end there's always fat. So what I'll do is I'll come back to where the highest point is again, start all over again, and keep working her as much as you can. Come nice and then see if I can show this a little better, you just push it off. Again, work this down, work this side down. Back on top here and work it down. And I get back up in here and start working it again. We're on the back again. And I'll come back. See, we've got a high spot here. So I'll work it down, get it even. Get a lot of access when you're as it's going, it just builds up and stuff, so try to keep my cleaner there. So back at it again. find a spot like this one here you see just run it off the get rid of her same with down here at the end I just kind of go right around the whole thing just make sure it's all cleaned off
keep working it. You just take it right off. You should right off the back side of the hide. This leg, there's a little bit there. See it there? That's looking pretty good. I'll work this tail a little bit here. I'll get it in there and I'll get the stretcher out a little. Push her off. Come back to this big chunk of fat. Work her away. Doesn't come right away. Work one side, hit it on the other side. pressure so we're getting there it looks like we're just about there well now like I said what I do is at the end I just go around right at the bottom of the cuts I just see if there's any excess fat anywhere kicking around see there's some right here if you guys can see it you know so I'm just gonna get in there Work it away. Another one. Right in here by the crotch, a little bit of meat. Work it from side to side, but it's very, very thin here. It's like you can see in here, it's right against the beam. You can really feel it, you can hear it. See there, I popped a hole just like that. So, what I do is just kind of kind of didn't pop it, more tore it, but I'd be a little more. Gentle. And just check it out, looks pretty good. Work it again here. It looks like we got it, one flushed coyote. Don't hardly see like this here, I won't work it anymore, is that membrane ain't gonna come off, so. Or if you guys seen that there. This membrane right about here, I'm not going to come off. It looks like he's pretty much 
No more fat on them. It looks pretty darn good. And one fleshed coyote. So they'll be ready for the board. I'm going to sew up this hole here. Get that done. And uh, just like that. So, I hope, uh, hope everybody enjoyed it there. So, like I said, if you, uh, guy gets fairly good at it, it takes me about a half an hour. Uh, and if everything goes good, some of them, like I said, it'll come off a lot quicker. So, but, uh, but yeah, it uh, works all right. I sure like my beam. I can put the pressure into it. I can hold it on this side. And you can really put downward force on it. So. Anyways, guys, I hope that's uh, hope that's something you guys uh, wanted to see there and how I do it. I won't say it's 100% correct, but uh, it seems to be working. All right, you guys, you take care. Any questions, just uh, let me know, or anything you can give me some pointers on, let me know. Okay, thank you.